All righty. April, you keep letting them in. I'll get started. Happy Sunday, everybody. How's everyone doing? Everybody good? Anyone, anyone on the screen excited? Is anybody excited? <laughs> I got to tell you, we're going to have some fun tonight, man. But April and I, we, we've just you talk about burning the candle at both ends, man, and just challenging yourself. We 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 have clearly done that. Um, you know, in the middle of all of this, I don't know if you guys know it, but we decided to buy a new house. And um and and we had to move in this weekend. So, you know, they they run out of inventory on Friday, which is kind of depressing on GLP one, but at the same time, the moving truck's pulling up, and I'm like, man. This is insanity. About a month ago, a house that we had been looking at for a little while took a drop in price and we offered a chunk lower than that. And a couple hours later, they said, OK, we'll take it. And, and I'm like, we've lost our minds. We clearly have gone crazy. But, um, you know, just to go back a couple of weeks, do you know, Friday, this past Friday, it was just two weeks since the GLP-1 was introduced and we were in Kansas City. I mean, it it seems like a lifetime. It, it's the craziest thing that we've ever seen. I'm sure for most of you, it's the craziest thing you've ever seen, other than maybe anyone that was around 15 years ago when Protandum first came out. You know, we weren't here, you know, at that time. So we, we didn't get to see that. We had a couple crazy things in our first company, happened that was similar to to pro tandem but man oh man what a what a two weeks when you sell i don't know if it's seven eight nine ten may i have no idea how many millions okay were sold in two weeks but it was about six months worth of projected inventory think about that six months so how many times more did we sell then they projected and the company said, oh, we learned our lesson from collagen. We we have so much inventory coming in. You guys could never sell it all. <laughs> Six months inventory lasted two weeks. I mean, just absolute insanity. But there, um, for those of you that may not be aware, obviously they're expected to be out about six weeks. They're trying to do what they can to shorten that up. But it's going to go out in the order that it's been placed. Okay. So if you have customers that, you know, new customers that want to use it, they, they should order it now. Okay. And be in the front of the line and they'll be the first ones to, you know, to get it shipped to them. Um, but I'll tell you, I've seen numbers. I know I saw Rachel was up half a million in just two weeks. Tara was up over a million. The pose were up over 1.6 million. That, that's all on Carrie's lines. And Carrie's probably up a billion. Who the heck knows what, what her number adds up to, but that's all her team. Um, it's been wild, but our team, okay? We're here to talk about our team. And I just, this is not the end of the month. Next Sunday, we'll acknowledge the end of the month, but we want to acknowledge some things now because some of you, went absolutely haywire okay with with what went on and it you know it was the coolest product in the world because you didn't have to answer any questions that's what i love most about it people just said you got a natural glp1 i don't need to get poked i'm in i they just buy it that's it no questions asked and and i don't like when they ask questions anyway because like either buy it or go away you know they just I, I i don't have time to mess around and man were they buying it you know i can tell you from personally um our second business is is getting close to ec2 which is making our first business close to ec3 so we'll see if we didn't run out of glp1 that, that would be that would, that would have happened already okay but um kenneth is getting close to ec1 um, Joanne blew past, you know, MC3 and is looking at EC1. It's let me let me give you an idea of some things that went on. OK, and I apologize if I leave a name out, but it's not the end of the month. But I, but there's some numbers that just are popping off the page when I log into the genealogy and I can't miss it. OK, first of all, Kenneth. 
when I was texting with him yesterday, and I don't know, he may have 100 tracks this month now, but he had 22 tracks yesterday. 22 tracks. He's only a couple points from Alaska Cruise, okay? It's just, just a couple points away. But how is that for a month? Up over up over 20,000 in two weeks. Can he get a round of applause for that? Can I see you clap a little bit? Okay. <laughs> and a great freaking job. I mean, just, just a great... Uh, now listen to this one, okay? That's not even the best part. He is now a nine times diamond shooting for 10. Wow. Do you know what nine times diamond is? That's 36,000 in personal customer volume times 30%. That's $10,800 in commission just on customers, just on customers. Okay. He has a second business too, folks. Okay. And he's and Leem and Tien, oh, they're all in his downline. Okay. He's got getting a massive check this month. Okay. Nine times diamond, and maybe next Sunday it'll be 10. Okay. So 22 tracks. Uh, I, I don't know what to tell you. I feel like such a loser. Okay. We 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 enrolled 12. Okay. I think 10 of them are consultants. They're almost all consultants. And um, and we have nine tracks. Okay. And, and I'm like, it wasn't bad. Nine tracks. I mean, the month's not over yet. You know, <laughs> it's, like, it, it's, it's just been the wild Joanne. Okay. Is all time high approaching. She's got to get a little balance in there, but she's approaching EC one. Okay. And she hadn't been MC three. So she blew by MC3 and is now looking at EC1 if she can get her balance right, okay? That's Joanne, okay? Jaya is at an all-time high in volume and is only about a little bit out of balance, only about three or 4,000 short of MC3. She has the volume. She needs to balance the leg, okay? Catalina, all-time high in volume, okay? All-time high. Dr. Goodman, I think he's on here. Listen to this one. He's only 400 points from Diamond and only 400 points from SE3. In other words, he don't need his downline to do any more. He's just got to go get four more, um, 400 more customer points, and he'll be Diamond for, for the first time. Moshe oh. Deckel's business, Dr. Deckel's business doubled this month, okay? Zoom is business, all-time high and doubled this month. Wilhelmina Fry. Okay, Dr. Fry up in Hilton Head, her business tripled this month. Okay, tripled. We were in Hilton Head. I'll, I'll talk about, we were in, we did two meetings in Myrtle Beach. We did one here in Florida. We did one in Merrill's Inlet up in South Carolina. And then we, um, we did one in Hilton Head. We have three of the largest medical practices in Hilton that had now signed on because of the GLP-1. And they were all interested in the collagen, but they didn't pull the trigger. Now they did, okay, with the GLP-1, and they're going to be representing the collagen and the protandum, okay? But the GLP-1 got them to pop, okay? That that was that was what pushed the trigger. Um, so a, our second business, all-time high in volume, okay? Getting close to EC2, and I said our first one's getting close to EC3. Um, before I forget... I want to say what an awesome job Catalina, Kenneth, and Fred did last week. We were that when we were traveling, okay. Yeah. And I think we're gonna give the call off one Sunday a month, every month. And we'll pick three different people to take 10 minutes each, like like what happened last Sunday. But thank you all. That that was a load off our mind. We were in the middle of a meeting in Merrill's Inlet. I, we couldn't have done it. We would have had to move it to another time. And you guys were great. Okay. So thank you so much for doing that. Um, Dana Demmer, her business doubled. Donna Gordon hit MC1 and her business doubled. Charlotte Bourne's business doubled. Jackie Gagliano doubled. Liddy Nash, where's Liddy? Hey, Liddy. <laughs> Your business doubled from one month to the next. Angie and Allie's business tripled from one month to the next, okay? Some of you guys don't know Tony and Gina Humphreys, but they were friends from church. Jackie is under them. Their business doubled. I mean, it, it's just, 
I don't even know what to say, okay? And this was just glancing at what was going on. Hey, Fred, do you want to acknowledge anyone quickly before we get into the rest of it? I know you're not U.S., but you, you're, your group does a lot of U.S. Volume. Yeah, we had a lot of, uh, we're starting to get more gem ranks, rank advancing. And um, uh, I myself, we started, a, I've had a second position for a long time, but I started building it and it went sapphire and uh, went MC1. Good. And our primary business is up 25,000. So awesome. knocking on the door to keep this going for EC1. Cool. So we're, well, just, you got we're five still days a bit left. away, but that, you got that's... five days left in the month. Yeah. Now, some of you know, um, we have a third business with our son, Chad. It's called Wagner Futures. And some of you see it in, in your upline. Um, that's pushing EC1 also. OK, so it's it's just gone nuts. And I, I, I can only imagine if we didn't run out of G, GLP-1, what the heck would be going on. But I'll tell you, I'm glad that we bought we, between 30 and 40 units, you know, we had ordered. So we want to keep our customers, our new customers supplied while they're waiting for it to get back in stock. That's why I know Dr. Fry bought 50 units, you know, to keep her customers supplied. And this is when, you know, there's times when we're not an inventory business, but if you're running a multi-million dollar business, you really should have some product on hand because sometimes when you hit the lottery like this, and that's what we all did, we hit the lottery. I mean, God has just blessed this company. If you don't think God put his hand on this company two weeks ago, you're kidding yourself. I mean, this was, you know, th this was the ultimate blessing and, you know, all I can tell you is it's time to ramp up your efforts beginning with tomorrow night. OK, what a story. Just think the guests that are on tomorrow night, the story that they're going to get to hear. And, you know, stories are the key. OK, testimonies are the key. Think of the story they're going to get to hear tomorrow night. And how could you not get excited about starting a business with us, right? How could you not get excited about that? And how could you not get excited about getting in line to get your GLP-1 when it's back in stock, okay? I mean, it's, folks, you saw it for two weeks, absolute madness. I mean, madness. Do you know, we had three wholesale orders. I was working so close with Hannah and her team. We had three big wholesale orders we sent in. We thought we made it on Friday. We're in the middle of moving on Friday, okay? We thought we made it. We sent them in, and I'm waiting for the confirmation numbers, and I get a message from Hannah. We sold out. I'm like, my three orders got in, right? She says, no. They didn't. And it, it's the good and the bad. The good is they'll get their product first when it comes in. The bad is, oh, well, I'm going to have to keep them excited for a few weeks until until it arrives. But if you can't get excited for the money, think about this. We pay out about 50% in commissions, okay? When you count everything, downline, you know, residual income, unilevel, all the gem bonuses, all the car bonuses, all the profit sharing, all those bonuses, we pay out about 50%. So if we sold, and this is not total sales, if we sold, let, let's just use a round number of $8 million in two weeks. Do you know that the distributors in that two weeks earned about $4 million? $4 million in two weeks on a new product. Do you think that that makes people excited? What do you think? Okay. Liddy, did that get you excited? I've, I've never seen your daughter so excited in my life. Okay. And I've known Erica for a while. You know, it, it's like, you know, your business doubled and you didn't even come to Kansas City. We're going to see you in Salt Lake. I know that. We're going to. I'm already like, registered, Bobby. And and that's, that's, and I got to tell you, that's Erica's aunt on there tonight. Awesome. Well, I Erica, I, I, I got to tell you, we, we had a little, we had a chance to share. I think she had an adult beverage, but we had a chance to spend some time with her. 
you know, and, and she's just, she's just a darling. She is, she, you, you've done a good job there. She's, thank she's you. Good <laughs> All right. But, um, April, you want to add anything before we go into tomorrow night? Oh, why don't you, I'll bring up the slides for tomorrow. And why don't you go into the value of between tonight and tomorrow getting people on? Okay. Take over there. And I'll yeah, I, I think the thing that probably you, you, as we go forward, you're going to be concerned with is, um, yeah, we're out of GLP one now. So what do we what do we say? I want you to keep in mind that you know if if this is a Google, you can just Google what are people most worried about today? Money, it's money. That's what they're worried about. So you know you can go ahead and you can show them that in two weeks we sold out of all this product. How easy it is to sell this product, and then how easy it is to make money. You need to talk a little bit more money, um, you know, and not just keep it all product focused because, again, when the product goes on back order, now what do we do? So we're going to be talking more money, and that's what we need to. Uh, Bobby's right. You know, most other than those that just don't think they can do it when I talk to them, we're talking about those that want to start a business, not, you know, just relying just on product. Because what if you talk to somebody who's thin and doesn't need GLP-1? Does that mean they can't do the business? No. So, you know, we need to be able to show people how to make a little bit money. And it is an exciting time. You know, you can look at the, you talk about all the different rank advances. You can talk about how exciting the product is. You know, we've got something category creating that is so exciting and people are getting such great results. It's the easiest thing to market. Wouldn't you want to earn off of that? Who wouldn't want to earn off of that, regardless of whether they were thin or not? they can show how fast that product is moving and, and just the back orders now that are going to go on. So, you know, again, that's kind of the twist that I've been using, you know, as we went into, because, you know, there were a lot of people in the hopper that, you know, they didn't act fast enough. I had two today that said, oh, I'm ready to order. I'm like, oh, well, too bad. You know, <laughs> you just have to wait now. But but we got some other products we can talk about. And Bobby was so correct when he said, you know, I noticed a lot of people that were looking at the collagen, thinking about the collagen. As soon as we brought the GLP-1 in, they were super excited. But I just want to give you some reminders um, about the Zoom tomorrow night so that you can be um, more productive. You know, first, tell your guests to be five to 10 minutes early. It makes all the difference in the world, you know, particularly if they're not used to being on Zoom as we are. Sometimes we just take it for granted how easy it is to get onto Zoom. But, you know, we all have that time where we log into Zoom and all of a sudden it says that we have to update our software or, you know, that it needs to be updated and that can take a minute or two. So, you know, tell your guests just for ease, you know, to be five to 10 minutes early. Make sure you're inviting them to a business overview. Now, I'm going to give you the workaround if that's not what you want to do. So let's say you're talking to somebody and you want to just talk about products. Then full disclosure, say, hey, first 15 minutes is going to be all about the products. They're going to talk business the next 15 minutes. But if you're not interested, just, just you know, log off. You'll find that I had more people stay on when I used to do that than not. So, you know, just let them know, because otherwise, if you do product and you've only sold them on product and everyone should be able to sell product themselves. There's, there's no reason why you can't sell product yourselves, but if they have uh, an issue with that, just take it away. Every time you take something away from somebody, it's the only thing they want. That's why the GLP one is working so well. At no point did anybody say you had to count calories. You can't eat certain foods. You, you know, you can't have carbs or you can't have wine or you can't have whatever it is you want. That that is that never came up. So, you know, that's why everybody wants it and everybody's getting good results with that. Um, remind them 30 minutes before or an hour before, whatever you do, but remind them people are busy, fast paced. So, you know, remind them right before the Zoom that you know, it's going to be um, going live in a little while so that they're there. And then, you know, the other thing is follow up. To me, the Zooms, maybe everything isn't closing. You're always kind of closing towards people, giving them more information. But you got to remember, particularly if you're meeting them on Facebook or you don't really know them, they're more of a, a cold market or whatever. You're going to want to make sure that you do lots of follow up with them. And this is an event. 
you know, this is our in-person meeting that people don't do anymore. People don't like to go to meetings anymore as much. So, you know, this is just another event for them to be able to attend. And there's been so many great um, cross-line um, uh, opportunity meetings going on these days too. But again, if you're going to invite somebody, make sure you know what you're inviting them to. So, you know, this is a business overview. If they only want the products, just say first 15 minutes, the next 15 minutes, not for you if you don't want to earn money. And then you'll, you'll find that they want that. So, um, but you know, some ways to get on it if you haven't been talking to enough people, just ask them if they do you a favor. You know, hey, would you take a look at what, what I'm excited about, whether it be the product or the business or whatever you're excited about, just ask them if they'll do you a favor. Um, and, you know, if you're excited about the product and you started to get results in the last week, you know, I'd like you to hear, you know, what, what this new product that I'm on that I'm excited about. You know, there are different ways that you can go ahead and invite them to the Zoom. Um, or it can just be, hey, you know, I've found a way to make money on the side really easy. You want to check it out. Really straightforward. So, you know, again, get better at, at doing the inviting. There's a lot of different things you can do there. But um, it, we have, I would tell you, in all the years that we've been in, involved, we've got a great product. We've got a great company. Um, and funny thing goes on in our industry. And I, and I know some of you are probably aware of it. Some of you that are more seasoned, maybe been around there are two things that go on in our industry. This is a time for people to join the business as consultants because the economy is not good. We know gas is up. We know food prices are up. You know, we don't even have to get political about it. This is when people are looking to earn money. And the funny thing is people will do things outside their comfort zone when they need to make money. So, so important that you do be talking more about people earning money because if you're talking product and they think they have to spend all the time, that's not good. But if they can see themselves earning, that's when this becomes good. So, you know, again, put that twist on it. When times are good and people have a lot of money, then we talk more product. But what I like about it, even then, even somebody that's maybe not a strong believer in their ability to market products, all they have to do is use the product, whether it be the collagen or the GLP-1 for a week, three weeks, you know, and they can see the benefits for themselves. So then they know that we do have a great product that does what it does because we do have category creating products. We have things that nobody else has out there and it's something to be excited about. But again, as we go through these times where people are looking to make money, that's the most important thing. You want to be able to show them how to make money. So, you know, I've got some really great category creating products that I can show you how to make money with them. You know, that's that's what you want to do, particularly while we're out of GLP. Once it comes back, you know what, if you're more comfortable just selling product, you can sell product and just let them get results, um, you know, and then they'll they'll have people that want to buy it and stuff. So because, you know, it's just such a big market share. So um, you're going to go over the two dates for Salt Lake and then that January virtual as well. Or you want me to or. Um, well, hold that thought. I want you to do that. I, I want to remind everybody, um, you know, obviously, if you want to see what's going on rank advancement company wide, the US consultant page on Facebook, um, there was a brand new presidential, um, Pam Gordon hit presidential, um, EC4s, EC3s, a boatload of EC2s, and a, a ship load of EC1s. I mean, it's, <laughs> And and that's you know I mean it is it is just absolutely haywire. I is probably over a hundred EC something because of the two weeks. Okay, that that went on. It's just absolutely crazy. And two dates I want to remind you about. And April's going to talk about something else. Um, we're going to be up in Chicago, um, on November seventh. Catalina, Jaya, and Dr. Goodman are hosting up there. April and I are going up there with um, Skip and Joe Campbell are going to be the presidential featured speakers on November 7th. So if you know anybody, you know, in the Chicago area, send them. We'll make sure that we take good care of them and they feel, you know, they feel at, at home. Um, and who from corporate's coming? Is that 
I think that's Gentry, right? Oh, I yes. Gentry, yeah, Gentry. Yeah, coming yeah. to that. Okay. And then two weeks later on the Saturday, November 23rd, it's the weekend before Thanksgiving. Um, April and I are the featured speakers. We're in Indianapolis on November 23rd. Um, Skylar Fobbs will be the corporate person that's there with us. So for any of you in the Midwest, um, in the Chicago area that know people in Indiana, come join us. You know, come in and we'll do a leadership meeting on Friday night and then Saturday morning is three hours. But think about Erica Dale is the host. OK, there. Skylar's coming in from corporate. April and I will be doing the training. So November 23rd, Saturday in Indianapolis. So I just wanted to mention those two. There are a load of meetings going on. Go to the hub. All the meetings have been getting at least 100 people there. So it's been nice crowds, you know. But April, what did you got? I know you wanted to mention Salt Lake, the early bird yeah. is running out. There, the, well, there's two things uh, for corporate wise. Um, January 11th, so you want to mark your calendar. January 11th is a virtual and it's free. So you want to start thinking about maybe doing some things in your area, you know, with some other people and stuff. And then we really want to mention Salt Lake because the early bird pricing is over on the 31st of this month. So October 31st, early bird pricing. So it goes from $159 to $199. So you save yourself $40 or in Bobby's, in my case, $80. So um, sign up, you know, before the 31st. So that or, uh, And you don't find yourself without a ticket in Salt Lake City right? <laughs> when it sells out. Yeah. And trust me, <laughs> Salt Lake City is global. It's not a U.S. event. It will sell out. OK, so we need to all get our tickets now. That will be a sellout because they're going to they're going to get their product GLP one probably before that event. And they're going to go nuts. The whole world's going to come. OK, yeah. it's not just going to be the U.S. So you definitely want to. And the one thing I want to share with you about events. You don't decide later if you go into an event, if you got a guest coming you decide now you're going to the event and you're going to bring as many guests with you as you can. Okay. That that's how it works. Okay. It doesn't work the other way around. It, you are the most important person to be at the event. And I'm going to make a list. I, I haven't, our life has been absolute craziness, but I'm going to make a list of everybody that attended Kansas city after this month is over and show you how important it is to be at an event. And I understand holidays. I understand not, you know, there's personal things that come up. People can't make it. I'm not talking about that. I want you to know in general what happens to people's businesses when they get juiced up and filled with knowledge and, and excitement at an event. What happens to their business? Is it 100%? No. OK, but of the 40 people that we had there, I would say 30 of them got spectacular results, spectacular results. OK, so I want everybody getting spectacular results. And part of that is attending. Now, look, we got six months. That's not by the way, folks, that's not until April. OK, so that you just got to circle the dates and 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 register and then just start promoting your team be there okay and if you're the only one on your team then you start it okay you be there and you build from there if you do have a team and you had a certain number in kansas city you should be looking to triple or quadruple that number because your business is going to triple or quadruple just by the volume that's going on. So you should, if you had five there, you should have at least 20. If you had 10 there, you should be looking at 40. Okay. That that's the way you build your business. And I'm telling you, and then whatever comes six months after, uh, after April, where, wherever that is. Okay. We'll promote that at that time, but April, you got anything else? No, I want to open it up for questions. Where at 8.30. Yeah. Hey, you know, I told you I'm down 14 pounds um, with the GLP-1. Anyone got some weight loss they want to share? I know some people just got it. Yeah. Some have only been on a week. But but if you've lost a few pounds or inches, would you say so? Just keep it short in case we have a bunch. <laughs> I'm, I'm down 11. Shirley's down 
four. Awesome. Nice. Awesome. I got you beat by one, Bob. So I, I, this is a competition, right? So I got you beat by one right now. <laughs> so you're 15? <laughs> yeah. You're That's 15? Awesome. Okay. Who else? Anyone down? Three, four, five, six, seven, anything? I did the... not lose uh, it, weight yet. To, uh, Tuesday, I weigh, weigh again. The first week, I don't know how to believe this. I lost five inches. I measured and measured and measured, but that's what I got. I lost that's five awesome. inches the first week. I couldn't believe <laughs> it. And the reason I believed it is my clothes fit so differently. You know, it's funny, Charlotte. I told April, I said, you know, I... I haven't had a chance. We played pickleball for a Halloween party last night for the first time in like a month. We haven't had time to do it, but I told April, all of my shorts, I have to tighten them all up. They are falling off me. And it's like, I don't know what the inches is, but there's inches that come off. And a lot of times the inches come off before the pounds. And we know that from our old company when we had our Bioline product, a lot of people lost inches first and then the pounds followed. And it's because, you know, with the GLP-1, you're not losing any muscle. You're only losing fat. And fat is fluffy and bulky. So you can see that, you know, the inches would come off first. But um, we're excited. I mean, our, our customers are going out of their mind um, with it. I'm glad... I, I wish we'd bought a hundred extra or 200 extra units because we could probably sell it to all of you for double, you know, <laughs> cause, cause we're out of stock. And now I'm thinking if it is six weeks, okay, then, and there's two of us, well, we got to put, you know, five or six aside just for our own usage. You know, we got to put that aside. Um, anyway, we'll, we'll all do the best, but sell excitement folks, excitement and enthusiasm sells details and specifics don't sell nobody cares they want to know they're going to get results lose some pounds lose some inches and earn money okay and we are going to be very very excited tomorrow night and your guests will hear a lot of exciting stuff so let's use the next 24 hours it's exactly 24 hours from right now to fill up that Zoom with guests and share this good news of what's going on, okay, with, with everybody, okay? It is not a negative that we sold out. It is a positive. No, it's all done. It is absolutely a positive. And I was telling Liddy earlier, that is God putting his hand on this company. That is exactly what happened two weeks ago, okay? Right. And right. who knows how many zeros are going to go after the number that already <laughs> happened? So let's share the good news with everybody we care about, okay? And get them on tomorrow night, okay? We'll balance it. We'll talk a little more pro tandem collagen and GLP-1, okay? It'll Because we want them ordering right away. But they can order their GLP-1 <clears throat> and hold their place in line. You do understand all warehouses, when that product finally comes in, they can't just send out 5 million orders in one day. You, you do understand that, okay? So they're going to go out in the order they come in. So don't hesitate to tell them to get in line now so their order goes out first, okay, when, when it comes in. But we will see you in 20. Anyone else want to share anything before we go? Zuma, go ahead. Zuma, how do you feel about Hilton Head being your downline? Amazing. Amazing. Um, <laughs> even the girls that went on with me, they are excited. They're fired up. Uh, one of them already lost six pounds. The other one lost four pounds. I lost two and a half that I didn't want to lose, but I want the belly uh, to go out. And more than anything, I don't crave for sweets. The noise in the head went away. That is what everybody is saying. The food noise and the cravings go away. And that is that is so valuable. But I'm telling you, Hilton Head is going to explode. That will be producing six figures shortly, monthly. That is, we have the three largest medical practices up there have joined us now. And they're all on the 
Oh, thank you. And another thing is I'm going to have a live uh, presentation in Charlotte because I have so many girls now in Charlotte. So um, it's going to be October 31st. So it's interesting that the lady shows that, but it's going to be like that. Well, if you wanted, um, if you want to let people know that they can join, is it going to be Zoom or it's live? It's live, and I put it in the blue calendar. I at least I get put it, so put it, it in to the, the college and group too. Okay. Okay. Put it in the put the invite in there. Anyone who knows anyone in Charlotte Thursday night live meeting. Okay, and Zoom it does a great job. So you doing it in Spanish or English? English. English. Uh, consult okay. is in English, but. Then again, um, if somebody speaks Spanish, we can switch. They're going to be bilingual people there. Another okay. thing that I did the last time that I did a, a presentation, the uh, PowerPoint didn't work, and I play, I pressed play, and they listened to Bobby and April. <laughs> yeah, and that's what, and and one became or, a consultant. You know, Zuma, that's very important to always have a backup plan. Mm -hmm. You saw it a few weeks ago here when the slides just went away. You know, you just got to be ready to wing it, man. You never know what's going to happen next. So you just got to be ready. But Thursday in Charlotte, if you want to see, send someone to a good live meeting. Okay. Anyway, let's fill it up tomorrow night. Oh, you're muted, Catalina. Yeah, I have a question. Oh, go ahead. Uh, if people place the, their orders right now, are they charged now or yes. when the product yes. gets shipped? They, they are charged now, the points count now, and everybody gets paid now. Okay. And then does it matter if they um, if they sign up in October or November? or it, it, So it's going to be first come, first serve basis, basically, to ship the orders? Yes. Yep. Yeah. And there's a full-blown detailed explanation in the Facebook group, the company, um, if you wanted the exact details, but what we just said is, is what it is. Um, corporate made an announcement when it went on back order, how they're going to treat it moving forward. And that's exactly anyone that orders now is in line. The points count for whatever month they did it. Okay. So it would be October. And obviously that would be part of October's pay and they just going to have to wait to get their products. So so they're going to be charged twice, October and November, pending orders in December? If they're on subscription, that could happen. Okay, that could happen. Or they could just move the, you know, the November one into December. I mean, you know how easy it is to right. move. It, but, mm -hmm. you know, again, and, and that would probably be advisable that if they're going to do it and get in line now to move the November one into December, OK, because they're going to be waiting to get it anyway, so they don't need two coming. They just need one coming. So, yeah, so I, that, that's how I would do it if if I were you. Thank you. I'd also be keeping a little inventory myself. Yes. On hand. <laughs> yes. I mean, you get when that product comes back in, we're going to order a boatload. That, that is yeah. the, the 30 I, I know we have are already spoken for. So. Yeah. It, where when that product comes back in, our inventory is going way up because, hey, you can write that off on your taxes, folks. That's a cost of doing business. And we're coming down to the end of the year. That's an expense. OK. And, you know, sampling is a business expense and personal use. So you can be a billboard is a business expense. So. Anyway, let's fill it up tomorrow night. All right. And advise your guests five or 10 minutes early. Okay, so we don't do whack-a-mole. Hey, Bob, this is Debbie Riggs, sort of building on Catalina's question. Um, what about consultants that come in with an enrollment pack with a GLP-1 in it? Are You're going to just... have to call and check on that. I've heard two different things, and I don't want to give an opinion okay. on that. I've okay. heard they held some GLP-1 so the enrollment packs can be filled. And mm -hmm. then I've heard that it's going out without it. And it, and they'll get yeah, that one out it. So I've heard it both ways. I'm pretty sure it goes out without it. They send all the other products, and then oh. when the GAP well, you GAP just did a couple business thing. packs. Kind of let us know what happens with it, yeah. okay? Yeah. But I've heard it said both ways, okay? So I I'd rather check with corporate tomorrow on that than <laughs> okay. Anyway. <laughs> It's sorry, it's 10 minutes longer than we wanted, but let's fill up tomorrow night, okay? 
Let's have a good night. Thanks, everybody, for getting on. I appreciate it. And we'll see you in 24 hours. Bye-bye.